That should keep the planet going. At least a little longer. Yeah. Okay, now everyone get back. Ah, I'm on fire! <laughs> Alright, now let's get out of here. Rendezvous at Sector 8 Station. Split up and get on the train. Hey! If it's about your money, wait till we get back. Oh my god, that fire sound is horrible, actually! Jesus! Oh god, it's over. Oh, you assholes! You have to knock the flower girl down? Excuse me. What happened? Uh, you better get out of here. Really? I don't know what's going on, but alright. Let, let's talk, flower girl! Nothing else? Okay, let's go. Oh my god, I can't wait to see... Uh, I can't wait for the remake just to see... How many people they're gonna show... On screen at the same time in this town. How big is Midgar gonna be? Wonder what that is on the wall over there. Let's see. Don't be fooled by Shinra. Mako energy doesn't last forever. Mako is the planet's life source. The end is in sight. Protectors of the planet. Avalanche. Hey! You there! Shinra soldiers, fight them! I can take care of this. I'm Cloud. S soldier Ah, poor damage! Give me all the experience. And your money. You guys are probably just doing your jobs. You guys are probably harmless, just wanting to go back home to your families, but well... Fight them! It's only three. Ah, seven. Ah, seven. Ah, one. Ah, four. You're dead. For the experience. Ooh, he is so close. Take everything. That's him. Hmm. Fight them. Oh no, back attack and front attack. Ah, oh, my ass! Ah, oh, my ass! Oh, you're dead. Ah, oh, one experience away from leveling up. Damn. Over here. Hmm. I could take all of them on. It's only eight. It's only eight. I don't have time to mess around with you guys. Enough babbling. Grab them. I didn't press X at that time. Was that the dialogue automatic then? Cloud never came. Cloud, think he was killed? No way! Cloud.
Say, do you think Cloud's going to stay on and fight for Avalanche? How the hell would I know? Do I look like a mind reader? Hmm. If y'all all weren't such screw-ups. Hey, Barrett, what about our money? Uh, nothing. Sorry. Uh... Cloud! Looks like I'm a little late. You damn right you're late! Come waltzing in here and make a big scene! <laughs> Is Barrett always yelling? <laughs> it's no big scene, just what I always do. I mean, <clears throat> it's no big scene, just what I always do. Fuck! Having everyone word like that, you don't give a damn about no one but yourself! You were worried about me? What? That's coming out of your chair, hotshot! Wake up! We're moving out! Follow me! Hey, Cloud. You were great back there. <laughs> Cloud, we'll do even better next time. Careful, I'll shut this. Oh, Cloud, your face is pitch black. There you go. Say, thanks for helping me back there at the reactor. Oh, wait, there wasn't something back there on the train, right? Last train out of Sector 8 station, last up at Sector 7, train graveyard, expect the time of arrival is 12.23 a.m. Midgard Standard Time. <laughs> this is why I hate the last train. Hoo boy! Huh? This is my house, so make yourself at home. Is that a man or a woman? I can't tell. I assume it's a dude. You see the headlines in the Shiro Times? The terrorists that bombed the number one reactor are based somewhere in the slums. Blowing up a reactor? They sure put some thought into this one. They must have had a real calculating leader. I wonder what they'll do next. Stop acting like a damn kid! Sit down and shut up! Please, don't bother the other passengers! This train... This train hasn't switched to security mode yet. I'm sure that will change by tomorrow. Someday, Avalanche gonna be famous. And me too. Sorry, my voice for Big and Wedge keeps uh, changing. I don't know if, uh, if I should make a Wedge uh, seem more dopey than usual. Kind of like Patrick in a way. But it's not a stereotype for fat dudes. <laughs> hey Cloud, you want to look at this with me? It's a map of the Midgar rail system. Let's look at it together. I'll explain it to you. I, I like this kind of stuff. Bombs and monitors, you know, flashy stuff. <laughs> okay, it's about to start. This is a complete model of the city of Midgar. It's about a 1 to 1 10,000 scale. The top plate is about 50 meters above ground. A main pillar supports the plate in the center, and there are other support pillars built in each section. Psst, whisper, whisper. The number one reactor we blew up was in the northern section. Then there's a number two, number three, all the way up to the number eight reactor. The eight reactors provide Midgard with electricity. Does Cloud not know this? Each town used to have a name, but no one in Midgar remembers them. Instead of names, we refer to them by numbered sections. That's how things turned out. Phew! Look what's next! Look! This is the route this train is on. The route spirals around the main pillar. We should be coming around the center right now. Each checkpoint has an ID sensor device. I got a drink. 
I need some water. Hmm. Ah, delicious water. Each checkpoint has an ID sensor device. It checks the identities and backgrounds of each passenger on the train. And it's linked up to the central data bank at Shinra headquarters. Whisper, whisper. We definitely look suspicious, so we're using fake IDs. Speak of the devil. That light means we're in the ID security check area. Whisper, whisper. When the lights go off, you never know what kind of creeps will come out. We're almost back now. What a relief. Oh, I'm done? Look, you can see the surface now. This city don't have no day or night. If that plate weren't there, we could see the sky. The floating city. Pretty unsettling scenery. Huh. Never expect to hear that out of someone like you. You're just full of surprises. The upper world. A city on a plate. It's cause of that fucking pizza that people underneath are suffering! And the city below is full of polluted air. On top of that, the reactor keeps draining up all the energy. Then why doesn't everyone move on to the plate? Don't know. Probably cause they ain't got no money. Or maybe... Cause they love the land, no matter how polluted it gets. I know. No one lives in the slums. Because they want to. It's like this train. It can't run anywhere except where its rails take it. Man, Barrett is huge. Yo, get over here. Uh, yo, get over here, you all y'all. This mission was a success, but don't get lazy now. The hard part's still to come. Don't y'all be scared of that explosion. Did you say that right in front of people? <laughs> Cause the next one's gonna be bigger than that! Meet back at the hideout. Move out! When, you, when you've been a train man as long as I have, you see a lot of people and a lot of lives. People meeting, potting, joy, sadness. After a while, it doesn't even get to you anymore. I'm not letting you go tonight. Wow. Isn't there somewhere we could go to be alone? Wow! There's only the train graveyard around here, and they said there's ghosts around too. Damn. What? <laughs> What's this person? Oh. Ooh, I can save here. Sweet. Are you peeing? What are you doing? Hey now! Oops! What on earth are you doing? Just butt out! Jeez! Huh? You came to see it too? There was a bombing on top. If this pillar should come down, everyone in the slums is dust. Well, there's no point in worrying about that. Hey, check it out. It's huge, ain't it? Hey, this is a strange and wonderful place. This is my place, but you can come here when you want. See ya, bro. It looks like you were peeing or jacking off. That's disgusting. Yo, Cloud, over here now! 
Let me save, Barrett. Let me live my life. All right, time to save. New file. Number three. What's down here? Oh shit. What? What the hell do you want? You know who I am? You can't pass. I got the miserable job of keeping scum like you from trying to sneak in here. Well, wow, you're great. Damn right. Don't waste time talking, what I always say. But, uh, I, uh... <laughs> Man, the sound effects. The gun, sound, the gun sounds are awesome, but it's like fire and doors opening. That sounds weird. Explosions! Explosions! Oh man, Avalanche is so cool! What are you doing, kid? It looks like you're hitting your mother. Did you hear? No, what? There's a news update. They said there was a terrorist explosion up above, and that this time, it was a Mako reactor. You know what this means? No, what? You see, I keep on top of these things, and if you ask me, if you knock out Midgar's power, and then all of his computers and signals are going to be knocked out too. Financially, there must have been about a billion gil worth of damage. And that ain't all. A lot of innocent people got killed too. If the explosion had been in the middle of the night, that would have been one thing. At least the people could have gone in their sleep. Wow, that's dark. Oh, fuck! What the hell's wrong tonight? I thought that long blackout was strange. They say a Mako reactor was destroyed above. I was just sitting here, drinking, watching the news by myself, and all of a sudden I get kicked out of the fucking store. What's up with that? Whoa, oh geez, I'm blitzed. I just love them homemade cocktails, but they sure do creep up on you. <laughs> oh, I could go around. Holy shit. I never knew I could explore all this. Interesting. Okay, go on ahead. Wait, can I go up there? How do I get up there? Is there a door over here? Yo, Cloud, get off your slow-moving ass! Uh, I can't go through, can I? Nope, I can't. Damn it. I'm coming, Barrett. Jeez. You're not my wife. <laughs> Marlene, aren't you going to say anything to Cloud? Welcome home, Cloud. Looks like everything went well. Did you fight with Barrett? Yeah. I should have known. He's always pushing people around and you've always been in fights ever since you were little. I was worried. Oh, let me check out something on the computer. Okay. Tifa, ah, the best wife. And not just because of her breasts. <laughs> I'm so glad everyone's safe. Ah, nothing like that first drink after a job. Hick, why don't you have one too? Yeah, why not? Oh, that's more like it. Even if you were with Soldier, you're still a rookie here, so you better listen to whatever I tell you. Oh, Cloud. Tifa really knows how to cook. Mm. Anyway, let me tell you about something. About what? Tifa always lets me taste her cooking. And look at me now. I'm roly-poly. <laughs> Who talks? Who says that? Don't know whether I should be happy or sad, but it's the good food and drinks that make this shop famous. I'm sorry, Wedge. What are you good for in this team? Hey, Wedge. You're getting all excited. Stop making such a mess! Sorry, Cloud. Marlene seems a little shy. I can't activate the pinball machine? Aw. Oh. What can I do here? I can't do anything. What's taking Barrett so long? What's he doing? Pick. Oh, don't tell Barrett what I just said. Can I sit down? What am I supposed to do here? Get out? Thank you. Pop! 
Koopa! Welcome home! You alright, Barrett? Great! Get in here, fools! We're starting to meet! Sit down. How about something to drink? Give me something hard. Just a minute, I'll make one for you. That was easy. <laughs> you know, I'm relieved you made it back safely. What's with you all of a sudden? That job wasn't even tough. I guess not. You were in Soldier. Make sure you get your pay from Barrett. Don't worry. Once I get that money, I'm out of here. You're gonna leave your friend here? Jesus Christ, Cloud. Cloud? Are you feeling alright? Yeah. Why? No reason. You just a little... You just look a little tired, I guess. What's wrong with Jessie? Why was she crying like, yeah, what? What's wrong with her? Oops. Hey, look at the news. What a blast. Think it was all because of my bomb? But all I really did was just make it like the computer told me. Oh no, I must have made a miscalculation somewhere. Yo, Cloud, there's something I want to ask you. Was there anyone from Soldier fighting us today? None, I'm positive. You sound pretty sure. If there was anyone from Soldier, you wouldn't be standing here now. Don't go thinking you so bad cause just cause you was in Soldier. Ha ha ha! Funny. Yeah, you're strong. Probably all them guys in Soldier are. But don't go. But don't forget that you're skinny ass working for Avalanche now. Don't get no ideas about hanging on to Shinra. Staying with Shinra. You asked me a question and I answered it. That's all. I'm going upstairs. I want to talk about my money. Shucks, money. Papa, you're so great. Wait, Cloud. Tifa, let him go. Looks like he still misses the Shinra. Shut up. I don't care about neither Shinra nor Soldier. But don't get me wrong. I don't care about Avalanche or the planet for that matter. Cloud, you say you don't care, but you came to talk to me. Cloud, you just want friends. Isn't that right? Blow off! Yeah, well, you look kind of lonely to me. If you ever got anything you want to get off your chest, you can always talk to me. Oh shit, I think I'm... Ah! No! Okay. Shucks, money. Man, he's fast. Shuck! Oh, Marlene, uh-huh. Strain things up uh, with everyone for me. Money. Oh my, it must have been for a lot of it. Sure. Well, what the hell? It's verbal agreement. Now let me figure this out. Oh, stop it, Cloud! Did you hear me? <laughs> uh, I'm gonna be sad when you die. Listen, Cloud, I'm asking you. Please join us. Sorry, Tifa. The planet is dying. Surely, but slowly, but surely, it's dying. Someone has to do something. So let Barrett and his buddies do something about it. It's got nothing to do with me. So, you're really leaving? You're just gonna walk right out ignoring your childhood friend? 
What? Um, which one should I choose? How can you say that? Okay. You forgot the promise, too. Promise? So you did forget. Remember, Cloud? It was seven years ago. Flashback time! Look, the well. Do you remember? <laughs> I want Cloud to say, I remember! <laughs> yeah, back then. I thought you would never come, and I was just getting- I was getting a little cold. Oh, I gotta do mini, uh, Cloud and mini Tifa. Sorry, I'm late! Wait, seven years ago. Oh, they're teenagers! Never mind, why am I thinking that they're little preschool children? <laughs> Even though I wanted to uh, say it in those kind of voices. You said you want to talk to me about something? Come this spring, I'm leaving town for Midgard. <laughs> Fine, I gotta speak normally. All the boys are leaving town. But I'm different from them. I'm not just going to find a job. Holy crap, he had a ponytail? Oh man, I really want to see that clown model. Look at that! I want to join Soldier. I'm gonna be the best there is, just like Sephiroth. Sephiroth? The great Sephiroth? Isn't it hard to join Soldier? I probably won't be able to come back to this town for a while. Huh? If you make it, will you be in the newspapers? I'll try. Hey, let's make a promise. Um... Whoa, what's with the music? Oh no, it's... never mind. It's still fine. <laughs> Sorry, it does... that that Elgato does that stupid thing to me for, um... Uh, uh, playthroughs. Um, if you get really famous, and I'm ever in a bind, you'll come save me, alright? What? If I'm ever in trouble, my hero will come and rescue me. I want to experience that at least once. What? <laughs> Come on, promise me. All right, I promise. You remember now, don't you? Our promise? I'm not a hero and I'm not famous, so I can't keep our promise. But you got your childhood dream, didn't you? You joined Soldier. So come on! You've got to keep your promise. Oh, he climbed that shit! Wait a sec, big time Soldier! A promise is a promise. Here! Receive Barrett's stash, 1,500 gil. This is my pay. Don't make me laugh. What? Then you'll... You got the next mission lined up? I'll do it for 3,000. What? It's okay. It's okay. Psst. We're really hurting for help, right? Uh, uh. That money's for Marlene's schooling. 2,000! Thanks, Cloud. He didn't... He didn't accept it! Cloud didn't accept! <laughs> he said for 3,000! Alright, I'm awake.
Aw, adorable Marlene taking care of a bar even though she's like five years old. Oh. Good morning, Cloud. Did you sleep well? Next to you, who wouldn't? <laughs> Well, I slept in the corner. Does that mean that Tifa was sleeping next to me, too? <laughs> nah, I prefer Barrett. Barrett's snoring kept me up. Psst. Keep it down. They'll hear you. Barrett's always edgy before an operation. I'm going this time. I'm going this time. Our target's the Sector 5 reactor. Head for the station first. I'll fill you in on the train. Yo, Cloud! Before the next mission, I got something I want to ask you. I, uh, I don't really know how to use materia. I'll give you that materia we found. Just teach me how to use it. Sigh. You and I think I'll prefer, yeah. So this is what makes them guys and soldiers so great, huh? Okay, I'll ask Jesse again later. But you're in charge of the materia. Materia system. Cloud, I got a message from the weapon shop man upstairs. He has something he wants to give you, don't forget. Marlene, you watch the store while we're gone. All right, good luck. This is a store, it's a bar. It's a freaking bar, how's it a store? What are you selling besides beer? <laughs> ah crap, I'm back inside. Man upstairs. Hello, peeps. He used to give us nothing but headaches when he was here, but now that he's gone, we kind of miss him. Strange, isn't it? Haha! <laughs> I wonder if my son's already left. When it's just my wife and I here, you have no idea how lonesome he gets. No gill I could steal? Toilets. At least they use a toilet. Ooh, that little boy, what you doing? When it comes down to it, I'm gutless. I'm still just no good kid. Listen, if there isn't anyone to listen, what's the use of getting gossip on everyone? Yeah, and you, Mr. I don't care. I'll get a little more information that will pique you even your interest. You wait and see. <laughs> 